With several beaches now open full time across the Panhandle, people are flocking to the sand, but it's also been a busy day for hotels. As News 13's Kayla Tucker tells us, several of them are busy making reservations now that the view people came here for is more accessible. We have a whole lot more people this weekend than we had last weekend. Open Beaches for All is attracting more visitors to Panama City Beach. Well, as soon as the announcement was made, the phone started ringing. Colvin says they're already seeing reservations, but not all of them are immediate visits. They're looking for further out, and they're, and they're calling to find out what the, what the um, prices are and what the rules are and everything, or they're coming like right now. Bart Miller checked in Friday from Tallahassee. He said they're tired of being apart from those important to them. My wife's family is here uh, on vacation. We haven't seen our family in a while, so matter of fact, since almost uh, December. Like Miller, people are bringing their families to Bay County to enjoy the sun and sand. But Mayor Mark Sheldon says while the boost of tourists is helpful for our economy, safety of residents comes first. Here on Panama City Beach, we live on the one cent, so with the one cent tax is what we really live on for a city. That's how we get all our money for our, our police, our fire, our utilities. So we do have to have the one cent, but we never want to sacrifice the one cent for the safety of our citizens. Sheldon is also encouraging visitors to bring their own masks, hand sanitizer and other personal protective equipment. News 13 tried to speak with other hotel staff, but they told us they were just too busy. In Panama City Beach, Kayla Tucker, News 13, Panhandle Strong.